Number 26, it wants us to solve this quadratic and it wants us to use a quadratic formula to do it. Okay, step one, get it set equal to zero. Is it set equal to zero? Yes. Step one, complete. Step two, I need to look at my values. The value in front of x squared is considered the a value. In front of the x is the b, and that little constant there is a c. Now, what is the formula? Remember, the equation is the opposite of b, opposite of b, plus or minus square root, plus or minus square root, b squared minus 4ac, b squared minus 4ac, all over 2a, all over 2a. There we have it. Okay. Sorry about that. A is 3. B is 8. And C is 1. We always like you to write them here to the side. I also like you to write, and it is very wise to do, 4 times A times C right here. 4 times 3 is 12 times 1 is 12. Okay. Now all i got to do is plug in, and I'm going to be in good shape. Opposite of B. Opposite of 8 is negative 8, plus or minus square root. Because, again, we're going to come and do plus that, and then we're going to come and do minus that. So we're going to get two solutions more than likely. Let's see. It depends what I get inside this discriminant value, the b squared minus 4ac piece. b squared, 8 squared. I'm going to go ahead and say, hey, that's 64 minus, and then I just look over here, 12. All divided by 2 times 3, which is 6. So what do we have? Let's scroll the board down a little bit. We have x is equal to negative 8 plus or minus the square root. 64 minus 12. Looks like 52. It's not a perfect square. Okay, So it's just going to have to use a calculator. I know 7 times 7 is 49. So that's like 7.1 maybe. Somewhere in there. But at this point, we can't go any further. So we're going to do the addition part and then the subtraction part. So I'm going to do the addition part here. Negative 8 plus the square root of 52, all divided by 6, and I'll do the subtraction part over here. x equals negative 8 minus the square root of 52 over 6. So now I'll go ahead and I take my calculator. I type in negative 8 plus square root of 52. Gives me like negative point something that I then divide by 6. It's going to give you approximately, when I did it earlier, I got about negative point one over here when i did this i got approximately x was approximately negative eight minus that square root of 52 i hit enter i then hit divide by the six and i got negative 2.5 rounded to the tenths so those are two solutions